let's graph this linear equation in two variables. And remember the graph is a line. So to find the line, let's find three ordered pair solutions. For example, what if we let x be 0? If x is 0, y is equal to 1 half times 0, and 1 half times 0 is 0. Let's let x be, say, another number. What if x is 4? Let's go ahead and show that work. Then y is equal to 1 half times, remember we replace x with 4. So y is equal to 1 half times 4, that's 4 over 2, or 2. So when x is 4, y is 2, that's another ordered pair solution. And let's find a third ordered paired solution. Suppose we let x be, say, negative 1. Let's see if we can do it mentally then. y is equal to 1 half times negative 1. What is 1 half times negative 1? It is negative 1 half. Now let's plot these three ordered pair solutions. 0, 0, that is the origin right here. 4, 2, we start at the origin, we move 4 to the right, from there, 2 up. Start at the origin, move 4 to the right, 1, 2, 3, 4, from there, 2 up. Remember, every ordered pair corresponds to a single point. Now let's plot this ordered pair. Start at the origin, we move 1 to the left, because it's negative, from there, one half unit down, because that's negative. So start at the origin, one to the left, from there, one half down. Now, if these three ordered pair solutions are correct, the three points that we graph should all lie on the same line. Notice here they do. The line through them is the graph of y is equal to one half x. And it continues indefinitely in both directions. There's the graph.